Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Single Mom Life. Look at this little cutie's face. She just woke up. As you guys saw from the last episode, everyone's needs were all over the place. Literally, Summerly is having the most difficult time kind of adjusting to being a single mom and grieving her husband's passing. Like, it's all just a lot. So, she did get to actually get her needs up all while Phelan slept, which is amazing. She took a nap. She, you know, her energy's not all the way up, but it's a lot better. It was literally so low. She managed to get a shower in and everything. So, this is good. Oh, are you going to go help out with her? Because honestly, that would be amazing. I mean, we're going to go see her anyways. She needs to eat. Oh, are you crying? Cry to okay, wait, are you going to bottle feed her? Because honestly, that would be so, so helpful right now. I would love you for that. Are we bottle feeding? Okay. <laughs> Amazing. So the grandparents are saving the day. We love that. So because she is doing that, we can actually go out and take care of our poor animals because, oh my goodness. So we need to clean your shed. This is bad. You know, I feel like, you know, she's really overwhelmed and she's going to try to see if she can kind of take this all on. But she's really starting to feel like she may have to get rid of some of the farm animals and that breaks her heart. I feel like she definitely has a connection with the horses, which oh my god, right now we have four horses in here, but only two of them are ours. So Oreo and then of course Willow. It's confusing because Drover and Willow look so much alike, but yeah, this is the grandparents' horses. So, well, her parents. So yeah, usually there's only two horses here and I do feel like she has more of a connection with the horses. But, like, I really feel like she's debating if she can handle all these chickens and if she can handle a cow and a llama. You know, like, I feel like it's just really hard for her and she's kind of just, like, she's kind of just, like, rethinking everything and doesn't know what to do. But she will try her best and hopefully she can kind of, you know make things work out. The thing is with the farmhand, uh, you really just want to tend to all the gardening stuff or ranch hand, I should say. So yeah, like, can we tell you what to do perhaps? Because honestly, that would be amazing, but I'm not sure if that's something we could do. Ranch hand. Okay. Assign chores. Cause I feel like the gardening is like, it's important, but it's not as important. Let's do livestock and horse care because yeah, Please, please, please take care of our farm animals. That would be absolutely amazing. We can also do actions. We can fire, set a schedule, ask to collect manure. Let's do that too. <laughs> okay, so, oh, someone's riding a horse over here. She's so upset, you guys. I feel like she needs to get out, honestly. Like, I really do feel like she needs to get out, but at the same time, I feel like she just wants to be with Phelan. Oh, laugh milestone unlocked. My heart. It looks like she is going to go on her diaper shortly. But like, ugh. Girl, I'm so sorry. She can't even be bothered to get dressed for the day. And like, can we blame her? <laughs> like, the chickens are so filthy. Oh no! Oh my god, this is the last thing she needs right now. Like the last thing. Is she gonna get a bat? Yes. Stung from bees. I'm so freaking sorry. Okay. So <laughs> we really like. Oh my goodness. Aren't you supposed to like clean yourself? Is, I don't even know. Like, why are you that filthy? I don't know. D does anyone know why you're this filthy? Because no one else is. Oh, no way. They are too. Okay. How do I want to feed? I want to clean them. Why can we not just clean them? This is so weird. Am I like going crazy? I don't know, but I definitely feel like she's going to be getting rid of some of these um, chickens. I just feel like she kind of can't deal with it. Oh, you do clean yourself. Okay. That's what I thought. <laughs> because now you're clean. I don't know why they're just like leaving themselves dirty for so long. Look, she's already so sad and has to go back to cry in her bed. My freaking heart. I'm going to let her cry it out because honestly, I feel like she needs to. And oh, look at you. So Sebastian is trying to help out. She needs her diaper change, dude. I guess we're not doing that. What is this? Um, looking good from new style. Oh, <laughs> Okay, well, I don't know what kind of new style you- wait, do you look different? I don't think so. I don't know. But anyways, we are gonna let her cry it out and then, girl, you've got to change the diaper. Change Phelan's diaper. Oh, it looks like she's gonna cancel it out. That's okay. I don't want to just leave her crying. Like, that breaks my heart. Oh my god! They're literally going to have sex. We're not even gonna go look. Love that. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad the grandparents relationship is going strong, but we didn't need to know that. Can't you wait till you go home? 
All right, so we're getting her diaper changed and then she's feeling really good. So let's go ahead and put her there and then we're gonna do some tummy time, I think. I feel like she feels like it's like impossible to get out at this point. Like there's just all these farm animals that she doesn't even know like what to do with. It's a lot. It's definitely, oh no, we need to, oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. Um, 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 okay, actually I'm not even gonna risk it. Where are you? I'm not, what's happening? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, oh, I didn't know what this was. We got the grab milestone, yay. All right, so it's definitely challenging having a, can we stop like flying? Oh, it's actually, it's my fault. It's because like, okay, ignore me. Bottle feed. I like how we're already overwhelmed. Like, <laughs> like what the heck? Okay, so other than that, you're feeling good. So we love that. You're uh dirty, I think. You just want to sleep and sleep and sleep. But like, yeah, we really need to take care of you. So we're going to wake you up after that and we're going to try to get you taken care of. Like, we want to do tummy time. Okay, I've just discovered where the grandparents are doing the thing. So, <laughs> we're going to ignore that. But luckily, they are in the spare bedroom, so that's good. Okay, there we go. You're getting your feeding in. She's so upset. We have to get a picture. She is literally crying. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. This picture is, like, literally breaking my heart. Are you joking? I feel so bad for her. At least it's a beautiful day out. Can we take a minute how gorgeous she is? I just, oh, I love her. Even though she's so sad, why she just be over here looking like a model? Like, you girl, you really are. I could literally take pictures of her for days. I feel so bad. Okay, go ahead and resume that. So she's gonna be, oh, okay, this is gonna go away in 10 hours, which will be really nice for her. Okay, and then she's gonna start to feel a little bit of relief, so that's good. So like I said, other than that, you're fine, but then Willow definitely needs some tending to, for sure, so we'll make sure to do that. Oh, you're feeling tired. Can you try to go night-night? Let's try to do that here. That feeding just took forever. I think that's the hardest part of it all. <laughs> like, everything takes very long. Oh, what is this? I am once again asking for your financial support. How did you get this number? Never call me again. Yeah, like, why do you... I don't know. <laughs> She's like, what the heck? Like, what do you want? Oh, no. Cog in the machine. From getting a political phone call. Okay. Aren't you supposed to be going to wake... Oh, wait. Are you going... Okay, you're going this way. This farm is so big. That's another thing. I feel like it takes her forever to get around. <laughs> to be honest. Like, I think she's like gonna debate if she wants to sell this property, get a smaller farm, and just have the horses or something. Like, I feel like she's gonna have a lot of questions. And you guys can, of course, comment your suggestions down below. But I just want to think of this realistically. You know, if she, if this really happened, this would be very, very overwhelming. And, you know, I do think she has this bond with the horses. I definitely think she would want to keep the horses for sure. But I think she's conflicted as far as, you know, the other animals. Maybe she'd want to keep the cow. Like, I just think it's hard for her to decide. And girl, are you serious right now? Why can't we take care of you in here? No, <laughs> we need to take care of you. Like, our... okay, wait, go here. And then we're going to go ahead and call over pets. We're going to call Willow over. And we got to take care of you. I'm so sorry. All right. Okay, let's get you taken care of because you need it. Okay, let's clean your hooves. Let's brush your coat. And okay, so you're starving. Oh my God, your hygiene's low, which we're trying to get taken care of. Okay, so we also want to go ahead and do friendly and we want to talk to you. Let's go ahead and go to friendly again and we'll tell a joke. Okay, so is this helping at all? Okay, hygiene's good now. Your social is poor, your fun's poor, and you're starving. Do we have any food left? We do. Okay, so after that, we're gonna go ahead and ask Horse to eat. We're gonna ask Willow to eat. Okay, and then how are you still feeling? Oh, stop, stop. You're getting to know your family member? Okay, you feel great, this is fabulous. And then soon you will be oh, good to go, oh no. We have foxes. I feel like that's another thing that's stressing her out. Foxes keep coming onto the property. She personally doesn't know how to deal with it, whereas her husband did. And, you know, she's worried about the chickens. So she just keeps debating, like, what she wants to do. I could see her, like, you know, making the decision to move to a smaller farm and have the horses still and maybe keep a cow or something. I don't know. But she's really trying right now. Like, she doesn't want to do that. She wants to, you know, make this work because she's like, you know, 
I don't want to give up, right? Like, she's really trying. So, we'll kind of see. Uh, we're going to go ahead. Oh, wait. I want to wake her. So, we're going to wake her up. I want to get some tummy time in. So, we're going to try that. She's literally stayed in her pajamas all day because she cannot be bothered. So, let's go ahead and go to friendly activities. Tummy time. Oh, it's okay. Let's do some tummy time. Aww. Okay, we got this. And then you're going to eat. She's always, see, like, another thing is I feel like Summerlee is really, re like, neglecting her needs because she wants to make sure everyone else is okay while she's in the process of grieving. And, like, you know what I mean? Like, she should be taking care of her own self. So that's been a struggle for her. So another thing that she's been debating is going on a vacation just with Phelan, you know, and then she can have the parents take care of the farm. She won't be responsible for that in the farmhand. The only thing that's holding her back is like she doesn't want to leave the horses. Like she just feels this bond with them. Oh, yay. Lift head milestone. But yeah, I think she's really debating planning a vacation. And I think she will choose to do that in the end. It's just she feels like she needs to kind of get away and just have time to like grieve without all the chaos. And she just wants to be with Phelan. Like she just wants one on one time with her. And that's been a real struggle. So we're going to go ahead and feed her. So let's do bottle feed. Oh no, now you're scared. See, I just feel like this is a lot for her. And I literally feel like she's going to want to plan a vacation in the morning. Okay, so she's getting tired and Phelan might go in her diaper soon. But what we're going to do is go ahead and put her to sleep. Oh, you literally just fed her. <laughs> and then she's going to go ahead and head to the bathroom really fast. And she's going to grab something to eat, go to sleep for the night. And then she's going to go on a vacation. <laughs> like, she's really going to do that. She just, like, doesn't know what else to do. And there was this nice place that was available. She has the money. And she was like, you know what? I'm getting out of here for a bit. The parents agreed to kind of look out for the farm and everything. Does she want, like, some comfort food? I think that would actually be good. But then also, I feel like she just wants a quick meal. Yeah. Like, let's go to snacks. And let's do, oh, let's, uh, yeah, I definitely think she would want a milkshake or something. I think a Cookie Monster milkshake sounds fabulous right now. So she's going to grab that. I know she's starving, so hopefully it fills her enough. And then she's going to pass the heck out. In the morning, they're going to head off to a relaxing vacation. Honestly, Sulani would be really, really nice for her, I feel like. But also Tartosa would be too. Just like, I feel like she needs somewhere very calming. So one of the two, I think she'll definitely go for. Drink your milkshake, girl. What are you doing? Okay, this looks delicious. <laughs> Look how good that looks. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? Are you joking? That looks so good. Oh, she's going to also have her period soon, which I feel like she just also, that's why she's so freaking overwhelmed. So if this doesn't fill her very much, I'm going to have her quickly grab something else and then just go to bed. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a vacation. We need it. We can bring the horses, but I just don't think she wants to. You know, the farmhand's there. I keep saying the farmhand, but it's a ranch hand, but like same thing. <laughs> and then the, the parents are there. You know, she just, she needs this. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And I think this will be really, really good. I think it'll also be a great opportunity for her to really have one-on-one -on -one time with Phelan and kind of maybe even teach her how to sit up, just like really get that time she needs. I feel like she is kind of starting to feel like Phelan is like behind on her development because she hasn't been able to have very much one-on-one -on -time, one -on -one time with her as she could when her husband was alive. You know, her husband would kind of like do everything on the farm and he was really good at keeping up with everything and it was his full-time job. So, you know, it's just different. Okay, there's actually no vacation homes placed down in Sulani, it looks like. So I feel like we'd have to go to Tartosa or we'd have to go to one of the actual vacation worlds, which can we take a minute? There hasn't been another destination world in so long. And like, I always wonder why. But yeah, I think we'll go ahead and go to Tartosa. I think that'll be very, very relaxing for her. So we have this nice vacation home here. So we have this nice vacation home here that we can go to. I may even like replace it, but also this looks beautiful. I feel like it would be completely fine, but also I just kind of want to take a look. I don't know if there's any new vacation homes, to be honest. I think it's kind of the same ones that are usually here. I don't think there's any vacation homes place that like I, you know, <laughs> I mean, this would be a nice place to go on a vacation, to be honest, because like it's good for Phelan and stuff. We can go here. I don't know. I feel like she wants like a truly relaxing place to just 
be with Phelan. Like, that's just what she wants. And this will kind of like look out onto the water. So I think this is probably our best bet because we can also go to the beach over here, which I think will be really, really nice. So let's go ahead and go. Honestly, money is not an issue. So she's not too worried about it. And we're going to go for two days. There's a nice hot tub in the back and everything. I think she'll really, really appreciate this place. Oh, first vacation milestone unlocked. Oh my God. So she literally arrived in her pajamas, but she did dress Phelan for the day. We love that. So let's go ahead and take a look at our vacation home. Like I said, I could replace it with another one. Like this is definitely nice and relaxing, but if we wanted to, I could go ahead and replace it. If not, I'll go ahead and just change up this room so it has everything that Phelan needs. Okay, so I did go ahead and decide to replace it. I got this Tartosa Family Rental and it's by Lacey Lena. It is gorgeous. Definitely go ahead and give this a download, but it looks beautiful. I just had to go ahead and get this one for her because this is just the ultimate relaxation, I feel like. Does it fit the greatest on this lot? No, <laughs> but that's okay. I feel like it's just beautiful. This will be so relaxing for her. So other than that, the inside is also so cute and cozy. Like it's it's so her vibe. Like I just feel like it's so, so her. This is somewhere she'd live if her husband like wasn't all about the farm life. Um, and it's very like compact, cozy. All we gotta do is just go ahead and get a crib. What I might do is get like this one so it kind of seems like she just brought like the portable crib or whatever. I don't know why I can't place it down. Is it the mirror? Okay, I still can't for some reason, but like you would think that you could. I don't really know what is causing that. Oh my god, the room is like open. <laughs> That's definitely not the safest thing, but you know what? Because we're in The Sims, it'll be completely fine. So I think that works out. Okay, so maybe we can put it on this wall instead. Is it because of the photos? Like, is that literally why? It's also making me just want to get like a regular crib too. I don't know. No, it still seems like I can't for some reason, but like I, I don't know why. Okay, I turn move objects on and then it does let me. And I think we will put it on this wall. Yeah, I think we'll just do that. And yeah, other than that, we just basically need a change table. Hopefully we'll be able to get to everything. I mean, I hope so. It is kind of like <laughs> crammed in there, but it's okay. Okay, we'll get this little diaper pail. Honestly, we could probably stick this anywhere. Like we're not even gonna need that dresser, so I'm just gonna put it there. Okay, so this is cute. Oh, do we want like the tummy time thing? I feel like yes. Maybe we can put the tummy time thing outside. I feel like she'd really like that. Yeah, I think we're gonna put it out here. Okay, so we'll just put that there. Cute. Oh my god, this is exciting. We're on a little vacation. What is this? Oh, new milestone. Oh, and then what's this? Oh, from breastfeeding. Aww. Aww. Okay, let's get you dressed for the day, girly. We're definitely gonna put you in your hot weather because it is hot outside. Look at how cute she is. Oh my goodness. So, straight away, how are you feeling actually? You feel pretty good. Um, you also feel pretty good. You're a little hungry, but like, I think what we're gonna do first is just put her down here and just have some bonding time because we need it. This is gonna be so like refreshing for Summerly, I feel like. And it's also gonna really help her decide like, does she wanna raise all these animals or not? You know, like, I don't think she would get rid of the horses. I definitely don't think so. But like all the other animals, I think she's just really conflicted. Like, would they be happier on another farm? You know what I mean? I think that's something she's thinking about a lot. Wait, wait, we want to help you out. Activities, tummy time. There we go. Aww. <laughs> Hopefully we get some progress done here. Look at how beautiful the view is. Oh, don't cry. Oh my goodness, this view. This is stunning. This really is beautiful. I have to get all the pictures. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Cuties. I think she still has some tears on her eyes. Aww. Well, hopefully this helps her feel better. So once they're done with some tummy time, I think you are going to need a bath. So we'll do that. I think maybe, yeah, we'll do that first. So is all oh, roll over to back milestone unlocked. Yay. All right. Is there a bath here? I think we just have a shower. So I think we're going to have to change that to a full on bath. Oh, we can have a little fire there. Oh, that'll be so nice. Okay. The, even though the shower looks perfect here, sadly, we are going to have to change that. So let's go ahead and get ourselves a nice shower bath combo. I think we'll do. Do we want to just do something like this? I feel like it works. Yeah. I feel like that looks nice and modern. I'm just going to go ahead and change it to the all white. Perfect. Hopefully that'll be okay that this is hanging there. Let's go ahead and give her a bath. So 
Give Valen a bubble bath. Let's do that. Or now? <laughs> Are we gonna do a bubble bath? I mean, there we go. Okay. This house is a lot easier to maneuver. I feel like she's also gonna notice that and be like, do I want this big farm? Do I want something smaller? You know, I don't see her leaving Chestnut Ridge, but I could see her just moving to somewhere smaller and easier to deal with. Oh, how freaking cute was that? <laughs> cuties. Aw, look at you. They're already just having the bonding time they needed. Like, you know, when you're grieving over the passing of your husband, like, I just feel like all she wants is just one-on-one -on -one time with her daughter, you know? And that's something that was lacking. She was so busy. Aww. Oh, wait, what was that? Oh, no. Okay, she just needs to take care of her own self as well. She'll be okay. So, after that, you're feeling really good. So then I think we can go ahead. I guess maybe I should have gotten like a tummy time thing in here so we can kind of put her down. I guess we can get another one. Okay, I'm going to get one of these ones. And um, I mean, the yellow kind of matches this room. Or I think that one looks a little bit better. Okay, so we'll go ahead and put her on there after while she kind of takes care of herself. Okay, so put Phelan here. And then you got to get a shower yourself, girl. Oh, who's calling? Um, I mean, I don't even think she needs money. We're just going to say no thanks. I feel like she's uninterested because <laughs> we really don't need money. What is that? Ah, okay, because her period's coming. So that's going to be starting soon. So we're going to have to make sure to get some pads and tampons. And let's go ahead and get you. Actually, would she take a nice bath? Well, she's really hungry. So we're going to go ahead and take a thoughtful shower. She's going to do some thinking. I feel like she needs that. So let's go ahead and have her look at the toys while she showers. And then she could go for a nap, I guess. Um, it says she kind of needs that. So, oh, um, Babel Milestone Unlock. See, we're already making some progress. She also has the TV season premiere tonight. So maybe she can actually be like, wow, I'm going to be able to catch my show. You know, she's going to have time to do that. So that'll be nice. So we're going to have her go to the bathroom. And then another thing we can do is have her actually cook a meal because she has time for that too. And I feel like she's actually going to enjoy cooking. You know, you would think she'd want to order out. But like, no, I think she actually wants some time to just cook. So we could do homemade. Um, no, we're not going to do that. Okay. What do we want to make? Various cu uh, cuisines. Fantastic. What's in there? Okay. Nothing she can make. <laughs> I feel like she, I mean, she doesn't have that much of a cooking skill. So, you know, there's not like a million different things that she can make. So then it kind of makes me want to have her order something. Like, to be honest, do we? Oh my God, she keeps getting phone calls. Maybe we do order a delivery. Maybe we should. Because then she can like order whatever she's feeling like. Okay, you know what? We'll do that. Okay, you guys. So I went ahead and had to order food a different way because my whole entire game froze when I tried to get food with the Zoomers delivery or whatever. The menu just wouldn't pop up and I can do anything about it. And oh my goodness, I thought I was going to have to redo this whole episode. And that would make me so sad because like we went on a whole vacation and everything. And I would have had to replay all of that to get to this point. But you guys, if your game ever suddenly freezes, try the Alt F4 trick. Press Alt and F4 on your keyboard and then it might just let you save. And then you can save and exit. So... That's amazing when your game's frozen. I, it doesn't always work, but I was so freaking glad that it worked this time. So I got to pick back up right where we left off. I saved, exited, and here we are. So thank gosh. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and just do, I think we'll do this one. It'll give us like some healthy options to choose from, like pre-made meals, which I think is exactly what she'd want right now. So what is she feeling like? It's about lunchtime. This looks really good though. I feel like she'd want some of that, to be honest. There's also some fish. Um, we have a whole bunch of different soups. There's actually probably a lot of things that she'd want. Steamed salmon and fresh vegetables. That sounds super good. Okay, let's hurry. That one is expensive. You know what? She has the money to spend. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and grab it. Okay, because yeah, she's really hungry now. And look at her beautiful view. Oh my god. I feel like she just wants to come out and look at the view while she waits for her delivery. This is beautiful. I think she's probably going to take a little photo. Oh my goodness. It's so pretty. Okay. No, 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 no. 
<laughs> no, that would, no, your food is coming. It's okay. Come back. Okay. Let's go ahead and take a beautiful photo. All right. Oh my God. Look how pretty. What a pretty picture, guys. Um, should we have, ooh, okay, that looks really nice. Oh my god, okay, <laughs> we're getting like so many pictures in the same area, but she's getting some vacation shots. I love this. Like, this is such a cute little idea. I like rarely remember to have my sims do that, so, um, yeah, I definitely think she would like photography. Okay, is anyone here with our food yet? Oh, here we go. Okay, our food is coming. I don't know, like, what you're doing. Okay, we're gonna grab it over here, I guess. So let's go ahead and accept our delivery. And then, girl, you can get some yummy food. So Phelan is still asleep. Okay, we're just gonna casually run through the fence. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this in our inventory. We're gonna head inside, or actually, would she want to sit out here and eat? That could be nice. Okay, you know what? Let's go ahead and sit here. And then we're gonna go ahead and, um, actually, let me just go ahead. Can I not put this on the table? What? Okay. Well, let's go ahead and, um, unload it. Oh, Charlotte's calling. Hey, Summerly, I feel like trying something new and exciting, something like changing careers. What do you think? Sure. Go for it. Okay. Where did that food go? Is it in the fridge? Oh, no, wait. Wait, what? Is it in the fridge? Maybe it is. She keeps wanting to go try to cook something else, and I'm just like, girl, no. <laughs> Okay, let's open this up. Here we go. So I really want her to sit outside and eat this. Like that just sounds super peaceful. Why can't we? I have no idea. Girl, eat in here then. It's all good. Honestly, I would love for her to sit and eat here and like watch TV, to be honest. Let's go ahead and eat this and then I'll try to get her to go over to the couch. I don't know if she's going to want to listen to me, <laughs> but it's worth a try. Okay. Can you go ahead and sit here and eat? Maybe? Okay. Perfect. No, 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 you're not going to come over. We're enjoying our alone time with vacation. Oh, and it looks like you're going to have to brush your teeth. Okay, so um, can we, yeah, let's go ahead and watch Peach is the new orange. So basically orange is the new black. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and watch the premiere for that. We love it. Oh, it's her breath that stinks. Oh my gosh. I'm always just like, what? Okay, so her breath stinks, but you know, she's going to enjoy her salmon. Yum, it looks delicious, even though you look super dirty. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and have her just brush her teeth down here, honestly, so she can just get that done. And you should be waking up soon. So then we can go ahead and give her some food and some loving. So we'll make sure to get on that. But she's going to enjoy her TV season premiere. Okay. So, oh, what is this? Jordan? Who's Jordan? Um, I don't know. I don't know. I definitely don't think she would be ready to kind of like meet anyone new like that but like i don't know why this random dude wants to come talk to her i don't know i don't know what's going on there but i guess we'll see if she actually tries to talk to him afterwards i don't know that's kind of weird she finished her premiere she's brushing her teeth and then we're gonna go ahead and wake up little Phelan. she's been having a, such a good nap okay i'm just gonna clip this off because it's kind of creepy i don't know <laughs> all right and then let's go ahead and feed her so baby care okay so now that she's fed oh wait i kind of want to get a picture of that hang on um okay first of all let's go to activities and we're gonna practice sitting yes okay but first the lighting is really bad in here but it's okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and get a picture of them anyways. Aww. Literally the worst lighting ever. <laughs> but look at them. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? The way that you are looking at your mom right now? Stop. Okay, so we're gonna practice sitting up, which will be super freaking cute. Oh, they're gonna go do it outside. I love that. It'll be so nice because like the sun is gonna start setting. Are we doing it outside? Maybe not. Wait, can we? <laughs> It'll be so much cuter. Okay. Are we practicing sitting outside then? Yay. Aww. Yay. Okay, wait. We need to watch this up close for the end of this episode. Like, how? Okay. Let's see how she does. We gotta get all the pictures. Aww. Oh, look at her. Maybe she'll literally learn to sit up on this trip and then we can go home and feed her baby food in a high chair. That'll be too cute. Aww. She's doing so good. Aw, <laughs> oh, Summerly is so proud of her right now. How cute. 
Okay, I would say that was pretty good. We're going to do it one more time, but I am going to go ahead and wrap up this episode here, you guys. So this is exciting. Her learning to sit up. So cute. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I hope you guys are excited that they're on vacation and everything. I think they definitely needed this. Like, look how peaceful the background is. Oh my gosh. But I'm going to wrap this up here. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you guys are having an amazing day and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.